you're holding something in your hand. Oh, very heavy and very weighty. It's the MPSC award, and we're very grateful for it. And I just wanted to say that I um, have a fantastic crew here uh, at Skywalker Sound. Rich Quinn, Gwendolyn Yates, Middle Stuart McCowan. We have a couple people that aren't here, Cheryl Nardi and um, Brad Seminoff from our dialogue team, Koya Elliott. Uh, it was a huge project. We had like several, several tracks of dialogue all overlapping all these children that basically had um, voices all going at once. Their voices changed during the production. Um, so that was, you know, dealing with all the pitch changes and that. And then just a, a director that's just crazy energy and matching his energy and changed everything all the way up to the last minute. So, uh, yeah, I'm just very grateful to have a crew that could roll with every punch like that. And I'm uh, very happy about this award. And thank you, MPSC. Yeah, you guys won for Super 8. How easy is your life working with Mark Alano's production tracks? Uh, Mark is great. I don't know when. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I think the uh, last movie I worked on with his tracks was Titanic. So that's been a while. And you mentioned J.J. Abrams. How involved was he in your storytelling of sound? Uh, well, he was absolutely involved. I mean, we did a lot of the looping actually at his studio at Bad Robot. We set up an ADR stage there at directly there. So we tried to get as much as we could uh, with him involved. Um, he's got so many different projects going at once, but he was very focused on our project, and uh, we got it done on time. And. Uh, sort of on budget. I just want to say one thing about Mark Alano. I mean, I was amazed at the at the track that he was able to able to like uh, acquire during the production. I mean, there was a lot of crazy setups, and I'm sure JJ works super fast, and Mark was able to roll with that. So I wanted to say thank you to Mark Alano and uh, and the crew here at Skywalker.